Well, as you can see, another one from Wayne. This is the sixth out of the 17 he got me, I believe. Two a week, I keep saying. Now this is Shrimp Night from Hot Butcher in Chicago. I've heard so much about this one. Can't wait. Oh yeah, let's get into it. From Paris, Ontario, we drew beers for breakfast, facts for snacks. Cheers. This one just looks so damn good for some reason. Okay, I gotta move my beautiful gift right here. Look at that. All right, so Shrimp Night. It's a double New England style IPA. And they are out of uh, Hot Butcher in, hold on, I believe it's Chicago. Chicago. Canned, yeah, Hot Butcher for the World in Chicago, Illinois. Uh, and Bedford Park, Illinois. Okay, so it's Chicago as far as I know. That's, I've had two beers from them. Uh, Shane got me uh, last year. When they were there, um, hops for brew right away. Hops for brew. Sexy Citra, Sexy Strata, Sexy Simcoe. So I'm thinking a bit more uh, skunkiness in here. And Mutiko hopped, double India Pale Ale, eight percent of this cool can. I love anything hop butcher, man. I heard they're one of the greatest out there. I heard, and I heard Chicago has like eighty different craft breweries or something. That's what I heard. So I got to get myself. Now, two glasses now are dirty, so what am I smelling the glass for? I don't know. Let's get into it. Oh, yes. That's the color I like. That is the color I like. Guys, right there. Look at that. So, it doesn't have a brood on date, which is, I don't know. Um, but it had hops for brew. Now, the tasting notes is it's zesty citrus, ripe mango. And juicy melon, okay? That's what I'm going to get out of that. So that looks fantastic. A couple chunks, but that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Yes, yes, yes. You are getting like a ripe mango in there for sure. Tiny little bit of pineapple. A little bit of pine. Got to get into it. Thank you, Wayne. If you're not subscribed to Bucks County Beer Review, what the hell, man? Way better reviewer than me. I'm just telling you. You guys just like me for who I am. Cheers, everyone. Soft, pillowy. Holy crap. Mango for sure. Up front. Then you got that little zesty with the orange zest to it. That is... Oh my gosh, okay. Shrimp night, eh? Wow. Uh, You are definitely getting like a honeydew melon, like a sweet honeydew melon in here. Oh my God. This is probably one of the best IPAs I've ever had, to be honest. I don't rate mine so high, but I could chug six of these back in no time. Shrimp Night is probably the highest rated IPA have had Hot Butcher is doing something good. This right here is probably 9.7 to me. This is good. Like I could chug this. This is probably the best IPA I've had. Guaranteed. Wayne, I'd like you knew exactly everything. This is a 9.7 for sure. Like I just stare at this thing going, how is this a 9.7? How is Hot Butcher that good? Hot Butcher is that good. Um, like, there's no head or nothing. It's just a... It's... It's the best IPA around. That is good. 9.7, that's all I can say. Mango and melon. And I'm getting honeydew melon like crazy. Wayne, I want to say thank you. Um, I got nothing else to say about this. Maybe, maybe a downfall. There's no lacing, but... Or date on the can, but... I can't give you a minus for any of those, so 
Nine seven it is. Be kind to your neighbors and try something different. Oh my God, get yourself shrimp night, guys. That is fantastic. Cheers, everyone.